Welcome to the ultimate showdown between two of the most exciting IDEs on the market today, Windsurf versus Cursor. Let's dive in and see which one truly reigns supreme. Let's be honest. Choosing the right IDE can make or break your productivity as a developer. But with so many options, how do you pick the one that fits your workflow like a glove? Today, we're diving into a head-to-head -head comparison of two rising stars in the IDE world, Windsurf and Cursor. Both promise to revolutionize how we write debug and ship code, but which one truly delivers? Stick around, because by the end of this video, you'll know exactly which IDE deserves your attention and your keyboard. First, let's talk about what sets these two apart. Windsurf is designed for developers who love simplicity, speed, and a clutter-free experience. It's lightweight, customizable, and laser-focused on performance. Cursor, on the other hand, is an AI-powered powerhouse. With built-in smart features like predictive coding, auto-refactoring, and real-time collaboration, it's redefining what an IDE can do. Let's break this down into what really matters to us as developers, speed and performance. Windsurf runs like a dream on low resource machines. It's all about speed with no unnecessary bloat. Cursor's AI features are impressive, but they come with a heavier footprint, which might slow things down on older setups. If you're coding on a rocket, Windsurf is the Ferrari. But if you're on an older machine, Cursor might feel like a bus in traffic. Two AI integration and features. Cursor's AI shines here with intelligent code suggestions, automatic bug fixes, and even code completion that feels like magic. Windsurf sticks to the basics, focusing on giving you a fast, distraction-free coding environment. Cursor's AI feels like having a coding buddy whispering solutions in your ear. Windsurf lets you fly solo, fast and focused. So which IDE should you choose? Let's talk about real-world scenarios, front-end developers. Windsurf speed and simplicity make it a great choice for lightweight projects like web design or small apps. Back-end developers and teams, Cursor's collaborative tools and AI assistants shine in larger, more complex projects where efficiency and teamwork matter. Now let's talk about the elephant in the room pricing. Windsurf keeps it straightforward with a free-to-use version and affordable pro plans. Cursor, with its advanced AI features, leans toward the pricier side, catering to developers who want every cutting-edge tool in their arsenal. Think of it like this. Windsurf is your trusty Swiss army knife. Cursor is the high-tech gadget you splurge on for the bells and whistles. All right, here's a quick summary. Windsurf Pros, lightweight, fast, customizable, and budget-friendly. Cursor Pros, advanced AI tools, real-time collaboration, and feature-rich. Now, for the cons, Windsurf lacks AI features and has minimal integrations. Cursor, on the other hand, is resource-heavy and comes with a higher price point. So which one should you choose? Here's my advice. If you're all about speed, simplicity, and getting straight to the code, go with Windsurf. If you want to leverage cutting-edge AI features and are willing to invest in a more resource-heavy tool, Cursor is your go-to. Because at the end of the day, the best ID isn't the flashiest one. It's the one that makes you a better developer. Want to dive deeper? In the next video, we'll explore how to optimize your IDE workflow to boost productivity and write cleaner, faster code. Don't miss it. Ready to level up your development game? Hit subscribe, smash that notification bell, and let's build better systems one line of code at a time. Because great code starts with the right tools, and this is where your journey begins. Subscribe to Hustler Coder, Windsurf vs. Cursor, the ultimate IDE showdown, new videos every week.